Joby Aviation could be the first eVTOL to serve flyers in 2025. The company says it's in the latter stages of type certification for their four-passenger eVTOL aircraft. Let me tell you about an exciting development in the future of air travel, specifically in the United Arab Emirates. There's a company called Joby Aviation, and they're a major player in developing electric air taxis. Just recently, they took a big step toward becoming a certified air taxi operator in the UAE. It all happened during the International Civil Aviation Organization's Advanced Air Mobility Summit in Montreal. Joe Ben Bevert, the founder and CEO of Joby Aviation, met with His Excellency Saif Mohammed Al Suwaidi, the Director General of the UAE's General Civil Aviation Authority, GCAA. At that meeting, Joe Ben presented a letter of intent signaling that Joby is ready to start their air operator certificate application. This certificate is required to begin commercial air taxi services in the UAE. What's even more exciting is that Joby isn't new to the region. In February 2024, they signed a major agreement with Dubai's Road and Transport Authority to launch air taxi services in Dubai, one of the world's most dynamic cities. In April, they expanded that partnership by signing a memorandum of understanding with several key departments in Abu Dhabi. This is laying the groundwork for Joby to scale up its air taxi network across the UAE. According to Joe Ben, there's huge momentum for clean flight solutions in the UAE, and Joby is excited to be part of it. Their vision is to create one of the world's first electric air taxi networks that's fast, clean, and quiet. On the UAE side, His Excellency Saif al Suwaidi from the GCAA called this step a significant milestone. It positions the UAE as a global leader in electric vertical takeoff and landing EVTOL operations, and the government is fully committed to supporting advanced air mobility technologies while ensuring the highest safety standards. Now, for Joby to officially operate, they need to go through a five-stage application process to get the Air Operator Certificate. This involves developing operating manuals, undergoing inspections, and ensuring pilot and mechanic training meet UAE standards. The process isn't new to Joby. They went through something similar in the U.S. when they received their Part 135 Air Carrier Certificate from the FAA in 2022. Not only is Joby Aviation making strides in the UAE, but they're also pushing forward in Australia with exciting plans to introduce their electric air taxis. Joby has recently applied to Australia's Civil Aviation Safety Authority, CASA, for the validation of an FAA-type certification. This is based on a bilateral agreement between the FAA and CASA, which sets the stage for quiet, emissions-free air taxis to take to Australian skies. Joe Ben Bavert, the founder and CEO of Joby, shared his enthusiasm for bringing air taxis to Australia, highlighting how these aircraft could provide more sustainable travel options across the country's bustling cities. What's key here is that CASA already has a regulatory framework for powered lift operations, making it easier for Joby to work with Australian authorities and bring this innovation to market. And this isn't just an isolated effort. Other countries are pursuing similar regulatory pathways, making Joby's push into Australia part of a larger global movement. Joby's air taxis are designed to carry a pilot and four passengers at speeds of up to 200 miles per hour, offering a fast, clean, and quiet alternative to traditional helicopters. In fact, their aircraft produce just a fraction of the noise and they're completely emissions free. The company has already completed over 33,000 miles of all-electric flight with its full-scale prototype. In a notable achievement, in November 2023, Joby became the first electric air taxi company to fly in a major U.S. city, launching from the downtown Man Manhattan Heliport in New York. They even demonstrated the quiet acoustics of their aircraft for a special audience, including Mayor Eric Adams, who announced plans to electrify the heliport. The certification process itself is rigorous, involving extensive testing and documentation for each system on the aircraft to ensure it meets safety standards for commercial operations. Joby was the first electric air taxi developer to have its certification basis published in the U.S. Federal Register, and they've already completed the first three of five stages required for FAA-type certification. In addition to their applications in Australia, um, Joby is also seeking validation for their FAA-type certificate from Japan's Civil Aviation Bureau and the UK Civil Aviation Authority. 
these efforts signal that Joby is well on its way to becoming a global leader in electric air mobility. In June 2024, Joby received FAA authorization to use its in-house software, Elevate OS, designed to enable efficient on-demand air taxi operations. The software originated from Uber Elevate, the air taxi division of Uber that Joby acquired in 2021. Uber Elevate had previously run the world's first on-demand multimodal air, air, air taxi service, Ubercopter, which used helicopters bookable via the Uber app. With all of these developments, Joby is positioning itself at the forefront of the next generation of air travel in the UAE, Australia, and beyond. Thanks for watching. If, if you found this video helpful, please like, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Until next time, see you on the next one.